Okay, let's talk about frame rate. Frame rate is calculated in frames per second. How many frames is a system generating per second for each camera? Live viewing, the, the frame rate that you're looking at right now with me talking to you is 30 frames per second. That's what you're seeing right now. Now the interesting thing about with surveillance systems is you can reduce the number of frames that each camera is recording per second so you can increase your storage time. Um, it's interesting that the human eye really can't tell the difference between 30 frames per second and 20. What that means is you can reduce or you can go into a camera in a surveillance system in a professional surveillance system and you can reduce the frame rate from 30 down to 20 and you increase the total days you can store for that camera 33%. And you didn't give anything up. Now, the interesting thing further is, you can do that again to 15 frames per second. And what do you do? You end up increasing the total days of, that you can store by 50%. Now at 15 frames, you'll st your eye will start to pick up the slightest choppiness. It's just very subtle but it's there. Um, where you start to get into trouble is, and I think we've all seen this in the old days, you'll see this really robotic frame, frame, frame. That's 7.5 frames per second. And the reason those systems did that is their processors just couldn't handle processing clarity and um, 30 frames or 20 frames or 15 frames a second. So you got the best clarity they could generate, but they had to drop it down to seven and a half frames a second. Okay, that's out. Those days are gone. But you can choose per camera how many frames a second you're recording to maximize your storage time. That's it. That's frames per second.